if we pump if we are pumping air into a balloon both the volume and the radius are increasing and are increasing and by the time but the increase in uh, reach of the volume and uh, the radius are related because if we have one if we know uh, one of them and the other should be known uh, because the, the volume is related to the R by the formula that volume is 4 over 3 uh, pi times R Q. So it, uh, we both uh, will differentiate it both sides by T. So we have dV dT equals 3 or 4 over 3 times pi times 2 uh, times 3 r square that is 4 oh there's because r depends on t you use the chain rule so that is 4 pi r square times d r dt so at at the given at given r at given r if we know if we uh, if we know one of dv dt or dr dt the other is no the other one is no that's the related rates Uh, for related uh, related rates problem, that is, uh, we have the relation with two. With uh, we have the relation uh, relationship between two variables, but but both of those uh, these variables are depends on some other parameter. So if we know one of the change, uh, one of uh, one of the rate of change, the other is. Uh, known by this relationship. That's the related related rates. For related uh, related uh, problem, we always uh, we always need to find the model at first, and then. Uh, takes the derivative, use the chain rule. The first step is a modeling problem. The second one should be uh, differentiate. So uh, actually, the most uh, most uh, difficult part is modeling the problem. Uh, let's use some examples to uh, illustrate the related rates problem. How to solve it? Example one uh, Water runs into uh, 
conical tank at the reach of five cube feet per minute. The tank stand point down. Has a H of ten feet. And a base radius of five feet. Then how far a uh, how a uh, how fast is water level increasing? When the H, yeah, when the water is six feet, and the H is six feet. To solve this equation, first we need to model in the problem. We draw a graph that as the tank is a conical. The tank is conical and and points down. Okay. The base radius, the base radius that is five feet, and the h. The height is 10 feet. So we know that the height is 10 feet. And the, and the, the base radius is 5 feet. Now the, uh, the water level is 6 feet here. Uh, we know that those triangle a similar triangle this one with uh, this one this two this two triangle is uh, our similar triangle so if here is six Here is six feet. Now we need to find uh, the radius at this level. Well, first we know that uh, the volume is one third. Uh, if this is uh, this radius here is x. Oh, uh, for any for any for any level, oh, it is uh, for any level we see this. Maybe uh, we can write this as y. It's y. The volume that is one third pi r square. The r is x square and uh, times h. 
but there's two there's two variable so it is uh, it's in, uh, impossible to find the related rates for uh, there's two variables so we have to use uh, use the similar triangle to find the y in terms of x. Maybe it's, maybe it's better. But we know that the similar triangle from the similar triangle we know that y equals 2x because the radius the radius is half of the height so we have the uh, have the expression for v that is v is uh, one third pi times x squared times 2x that is 2 over 3 pi x cubed Use a uh, chain rule. We have dv dt that is two pi x square and dx dt. When x is six six feet deep, when x equals six, when x equals six. We know that dx dt. Uh, we, we know dv dt because the uh, the water runs into the tank at nine feet nine cube feet. So we have. Uh, that is 2 pi x square dx dt. So we have a line equals 2 pi. Then when x equals 6 times 36, insert into here, and times dx dt. So we solve for dx dt. That is uh, 4 as line over 2 pi times 36 that is 1 over 8 pi feet per minute that's the uh, related rates. First, we got the relationship between v and x, and then take the uh, oh, then we differentiate both sides by t, or respect to t. Then uh, we solve for dx dt. That's the uh, problem. Uh, of related rates. Mm. You can see another example. Maybe we can use uh, a simpler, a simpler example. Suppose that x and y are differentiable differentiable functions of t and uh, are related to the equation y equals x cube 
find dy by dt at time t equals 1. Uh, when x equals 2 and dx dt dx dt uh, dx dt equals 4 because y equals x cube then take the uh, then differentiate it both sides by t that is du by by dt equals 3x squared times dx dt because differentiate by uh, differentiate it by uh, with respect to t so uh, x is a function of t we use chain rule here so dy by dt that is at x equals 2, t equals 1, that is 3 times 4 times dx dt equals 4. That is uh, 48.